Welcome back to my bonsai. My name is Chris. Today we're going to check out my grapevine bonsai. So let's go take a look. Alright guys, here is my grapevine. And I collected this here at the winery that I work at. Uh, it's not uncommon when the tanks are fermenting for it to foam over. And uh, in the red area, you know, they ferment with the skins and seeds inside everything. You know, everything except for the stem. So seeds get spilled all over the ground. The next year, start getting these things up and kind of they start to grow in the late spring. Anyway, I pulled out a couple of them. This is the Lone Survivor. So it's a Vitis vinifera of some form. No idea exactly what the cultivar would be. And grapes have a very wide genetic diversity. So even if we knew, say, this came from a Cabernet or something, it probably wouldn't be a Cabernet. At any rate, it seems to be doing pretty well, and I'm really happy with, uh, you know, how, how short the inner nodes are. You know, if you look in here, oh, we've got branches, you know, maybe every, or excuse me, we have leaves maybe every half an inch or so, and that that's pretty good. You know, grapes like to have maybe like six inches between inner nodes normally. So, it's got a nice compact growth here, and probably no doubt that it's in a small pot. So, I'm thinking my plan for this is to grow it as a head trained grape, right? So, in antiquity, the way they would grow their grapes, in fact, you know, even up to the last century, that was a pretty common way, is they would grow a trunk up, and then they would have, you know, branches that would fork out and then they would prune back to those every year for grape production. So they kind of start to look like small trees after a while. So that's what we're going to go for here. And for right now, I've got this branch on the side and I don't know if I'm, I think I'm going to take it off. I can see there's a bunch of other buds here that are about to push out. So I think I'm going to do that. This will be our first big cut on this plant. All right, there we go. That's half the vine it used to be now. So that looks pretty good. And up here we can see that we're, uh, are we starting to get branching? Doesn't really look like it too much. That was the only branch I think we really had. Well, that was maybe a little one starting here. So you can see, <laughs> it's so tiny. But right here, there's a little tiny branch starting to go. So, we're going to let it grow like this, eh, probably for the rest of summer, 